Hey guys, today I wanted to show you an application that you can get right off of Cydia. It's called iBlink. And what iBlink does is it gives you a whole bunch of like blank bookmarks in place of where you know icons would be. So um, here I'll show you what it does. There's the icon right there. It's that iBlink. And once you open it up, you can click on how many icons you want to be made. So I'll make like three of them. And it says three icons successfully created. And then you just exit out of it. And then wait for it to, it's gonna, it's gonna do whatever. Wait for it to load. Anyway, so the icons, you can't see where they're at, but if you just hold down, you'll put, you'll see the X's randomly, uh, put around in spaces or whatever. Not randomly, but you know, where icons normally are. Anyways, um, I use this because sometimes I like to take it and space them out like that. Right there, so they look pretty cool like that. Whenever I have a whole bunch of icons or like, um, if I just want a certain, certain ones up on the first page, you know, to blank out all these. Um, anyway, so I'm gonna show you how to get those now. Hold on. Oh, and also you can delete them. That's why those X's are there. You can delete them just like that. If you don't want them anymore, or you make too many. Um, you don't have to go back into I blank. Actually, I don't even know if you can do that. Yeah, you can delete icons. You just click on delete icons. And it'll remove all of them. Like if you made a whole bunch of them and now you just want to delete them, they'll delete them like that. Anyway, so, uh, dang it. Okay, so once it's done downloading, I want you to click on the search button on the very right corner, bottom right corner, and then click, um, search for iBlank, and right there it is, you just click on it, I already have it installed, so you're just going to click on install, then you can confirm it, and then it'll probably say, uh, restart your device or something like that, restart springboard, or it'll just say go back into Cydia, whichever. Anyway, so once you exit out of that, then, um... You just click on iBlink and you start making your icons. I think this is pretty handy for uh, if you want to separate stuff. Or like if you have a theme that has something up at the top. Like one time I had a theme called I Elegant, I think. And um, it had a clock up here and my icons were blocking it. So those blank icons came, into, um, came, came to be very helpful. So... Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed my video. Hope it helped you out a lot. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Rate, comment, subscribe. Oh, and also, um, I'm doing a giveaway right now. Not that many people have done it yet. Um, so just go check it out. It's uh, for a white Switch Easy Rebel Serpent. So go check that out. All right, bye.